NASA astronauts on the International Space Station are nearing the halfway point of their year-long mission. Typical missions last four to six months, but the two-man crew are on an extended stay. It's hoped that they'll help scientists better understand the effects of longer space flights on the human body. Astronaut Scott Kelly said he had prepared as much as possible for the trip. As far as uh, physically, you know, I feel, I feel good. You know, we have some pretty good exercise equipment up here. Uh, but there are a lot of effects of this environment that, that we can't see or feel, like uh, bone loss, effects on our, our vision, effects on our genetics, our DNA, RNA and proteins, things like that. And that's why we're studying this, uh, myself and Misha, on this one-year flight. And, uh, In addition to various experiments conducted on board, Kelly is also participating in a joint study with his identical twin brother, retired astronaut Mark Kelly. Known as the twin study, scientists will compare data from the two brothers during and after the mission to examine the effects of microgravity. Mark Kelly explained why the study is unique. We know people's vision gets worse over the six-month period, but maybe at nine months or ten months, maybe it gets really, really bad. And imagine you're trying to send a crew to go work and live on Mars for an extended period of time. But the, by the time they get there, we find out they're going to be nearly blind from the environment. That's a big problem. So that's part of the idea of doing this, this research over a one-year period, is to figure out if there are any of these bends in the curve. The space crew are expected to return to Earth in March 2016.